So, welcome to Story Fandom. So, we're here for our fourth episode, which is great. Uh, first thing I'd like to do before we get started is we posted our first video a week ago today, and we have gotten 10 subscribers. Yay. Which is great. I'm not going to deny. Some of those may be friends of ours we told about on Facebook. But hey, double digits are important. Um, but thank you oh. to everyone out there. So, <laughs> do you have a problem with me, Max? Thank you for everybody out there who subscribed to us. Um, like I said, we have he's writers. He's always done with me. He won't look at you now. As writers, we love stories and we want to share that love with everyone. So thank you so much for giving us this chance. We're going to keep coming back to you at least every Monday, bringing you right now just reactions, but we do have reviews and rants planned. He says 10 subscribers is nothing and he has way more, which is why he doesn't want to be on the screen right now. Trying to not be recorded. They'll find him. He's incognito. Anyway, so moving <laughs> on. Through a lot of technical wiz wizardry, I've gone ahead and made sure we have no more car noises. I closed the windows. I reminded him too. She did. Uh, we also changed seating because one of the big problems we noticed was that it was hard to hear Brandy. And seeing as she's the one who hasn't seen these, yeah, we'll let you guys actually hear what she's saying so I'm going to read the subtitles. I've got a little list here of things I want to make sure I want to say before we get started. Uh, we're also going to look into maybe getting a microphone. Um, something that we can kind of put between us, pick up all the sounds. Not just for when it's us, but also for when we do Ruby reactions and our kids are in the shot. Or if Max here ever wants to chime in. Got anything to say, Max? No? You're cool? Okay. Uh, don't speak to me. <laughs> you are below me. You are beneath me. You don't speak to me. You chose her left. Don't blame me. Um, but yeah, we'll look into that later. And we're going to go ahead and start uh, Sword Art Online Upgrade Episode 4. Which, again, I really love this episode. Um, I like again, you never said it before. Okay, fine. I love this episode. I love all the episodes. But this is where they start, in my opinion, to really start picking up in quality. Uh, so thank you to so Something Woody Entertainment for... You know, making these episodes. If you guys haven't, if you guys haven't gone to their website, I mean, they're wow. I can't talk. If you guys haven't gone to their YouTube page, go ahead and watch these videos there. Why are you here? Go watch them first. Subscribe to them. Come back. Subscribe to us. Um, so we're going to get started before we do. Is like kicking people out? <laughs> no, I'm kicking them out temporarily. Go. go away. Watch the episode. Then come back. Anyway. I don't know if I'd come back after you said that. <laughs> You're still here, aren't you? Not my choice. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> anyway, episode four, any expectations going in? No, but Max expects you to not lay a hand on me again because otherwise he's about to, like, slap you. He was very upset when you pushed me. Look at him, look at him. He sat up, he's like, what do you think you're doing to my mom? Don't you do that. He almost bit your finger there because he's annoying you manhandling him. He would never bite me. Look at me. He's a sweetie. Oh. I hope I face it, everything here. This is why I have to kind of communicate. I know I sound like the teacher from Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Bueller? Bueller? So I know I have to use my face to communicate. I just... Just don't use your chin. Okay, I'm not going to bother the countdown because it turns out in the editing process it doesn't do me any good because I can't come right anyway. So, we'll go ahead and start the episode. Max is just going to lay here. The following is a non-profit fan-based charity. Sword Art Online is owned by A1 Pictures, Amy Max Moche, and Jackie Kawahara. Please support the official release. You used to sing it, though. Come on, Silica. I need to embrace my living room. Just handle the dragon already. I can't believe I have to explain why you can't stand my friend! And I can't believe I need to explain why I need leather pants. Come on, Silica. Leather pants. Hey, if it'll make you feel better, I can make you a pair, too. I don't want to wear my pants, you monster! Well, there's just no pleasing you, is there? Travis, I don't need you. I'll for my own party. It's just gonna be me and Tina, and it's gonna be awesome! <laughs> Oh, 
Sie dort? Stop staring at me! It's creepy! You didn't like sexy Kirito there? That was super weird. <laughs> Can they just not? <laughs> Great. Good. So, who's that 
concerns. Yeah. Just stay calm. You already have everything you need to beat it. But how do I believe in myself? No, a knife! Stab it! <laughs> so it goes cute. Yeah, maybe you will cry. I mean, you're so low level, you're aggroing everything in this place. Oh, don't worry about me, baby girl. I can take care of myself. Hey, look, you guys agree. <laughs> All right, one down. Yeah, wait. What do you mean? Well, I mean, we're going to need like 50 more of these suckers. Then we trade them back in time for a gem, which we give to this gatekeeper, so that'll lessen for another dungeon where we fight a series of bosses to get the roof level. That's insane! We decided to keep this way! You don't play a lot of RPGs, do you? Man, that's a Yeah, but all over again. Yeah. Bam! There's number eight. I just, I just want to go home. Wait. Hold on, Silica. Do my eyes deceive me? Does the fabled word tree of Gamakora font of human knowledge and devourer of souls? Quickly, child, we must smooth away before it. Oh my god, will you just come out already? Ah, your detection skill must be quite high for you to have known I was here. Rosalia? Oh my god, how are you? Oh god, wow, that's not bad. Jesus, how do you put up that act all day? Oh, so you saw through me, did you? You're quite a clever boy to have figured out that I'm actually the leader of Titan's Hand. <laughs> Titan's Hand? Wow, I thought you might be someone dangerous in a laughing coffin. Never even heard of you. Laugh all you like. We're still one of the most feared orange guilds on the lower floors. Ooh, impressive. You can frighten players that think slimes are terrifying. Have you seen their eyes? They have no souls. Ah, oh, so quick with the snark. Of course, that's all you really have going on, isn't it? A witty retort to distract everyone from what you really are. A sad, lonely little boy with no one who loves him. Someone so dead inside, he'd use a child as bait to lure me out. Mr. Kirito would never do something so horrible. Now she's right, I totally did that. What? <laughs> and to top it all off, you play the tough guy. This invincible warrior you can never hope to be in the real world. Getting stuck in this game was probably the best thing to ever happen to you. But there's one thing this game will never let you hide. The one thing that's haunted you your whole life that you can never escape. You sound like a girl. <laughs> what? No, I don't sound like a girl. That's crazy! That's crazy! <laughs> well, it looks like my work here is done. I do so enjoy our chats, but I really must be off. We'll be taking the newer flower now, if you don't mind. Really? Who of you was going to take it from us? That'd be a neat trick. Indeed. But a magician is nothing without her lovely assistance. Such is a Mr. Kirito, there's so many of them. Look how bad you are. Ah, that's adorable. You think you're a threat. Well, you just sit tight. Show's about to start. Careful, though. The first three rows are special. What do you mean by that? <laughs> Um, boss, the Devonic first. This guy thought he was going up against Laughing Coffin, but he still just brought himself and a small child. You sure we want to mess with this guy? Please, the boys all talk. And now that I've broken him, he's not even that anymore. He's nothing but a gibbering mess grasping at straws. Ooh, another one of your famous theories. Tell you what, I'll give you the first shot. See how that goes. Boss, I think this might be a trap. Enough! You're all level 45, and there's seven of you. I think you've got this. Now kill him! Oh no! You and Spazali are really good inside his head! He's not even fighting back! Well, I guess it's up to me to save him. Wait, what? Man, you guys are out of shape. Maybe I ought to do some cardio. What are you idiots doing? <laughs> Quit screwing around and finish him! I don't understand! We threw everything we had at him! How is he still standing? How? Well, it's quite simple, really. You see, girly, you may think you got me all figured out, but there's one thing you didn't account for. My numbers are bigger than yours. Funny thing, really. Get to a high enough level and you're basically untouchable. My wounds heal faster than you can make them. We could do this all day and you would not be any closer to beating me. Not that it would be fun. But I got good news. You see, there's no need to wonder where your god is. This is right here. And he's fresh out of mercy. 
<laughs> well, way to prove my point, kids. Lording our stats over them like some kind of god. Your strength is nothing but an illusion to her. Thank God. I'm getting real tired of your first year sex streaming bullshit. Enjoy this while you can. It's the deepest you'll ever be, a woman. Well, you wow. did so. Gotcha, Dwayne. Damn it! Thank God. So, how are you doing? Fine. Why? Well, you did just kill someone. Doesn't that make you feel something? Oh, feel like what? Yeah. I don't have those anymore. Like cold turkey. Yo, what? I don't know. She was fucking annoying. Wait, the Sonya taste of revenge! You're right, Sonya! She's a... Uh, the heart? I don't know. Uh, awesome. You're a good friend, Sonya. We should go on more adventures. Um, I don't think so. Don't take this the wrong way, Mr. Kirito. I'm grateful for your help, but you're... like the worst person I've ever met. Is that a good plan here? Huh? When you feel feelings, you can cut them down a bit? But that's deep, kid. I respect that. Yeah, that's gonna be a problem. But I suppose it's all worth it to have me in the battle. That's the spirit. Let's get started. Beep a boop. Really? Oh, I didn't know I just left my room. At least they're correct. Yeah, I'm sorry for your loss. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> Some annoying characters. Oh, you don't like Rosalia? Oh, God, she was annoying. You don't like Silica? No, she was even more annoying. God, her crying was annoying. And her voice. She's <laughs> everything. The whole package. She was like eight. She was like worried about her skirt. Yeah, well, let's see. She's like eight. This, like, oh. anime. So, there's like that scene you saw with him crying. In the original, like, he came into the room and they had a, a talk about what they were doing the next day. And she's sitting the entire time, like, in her underwear. Or at least the beginning of it. And then she, like, changes into pajamas after the porch. Like, she, but she opens the door in it. It's like pure fan service of, like, a pubescent, prepubescent girl. It's just like. I think whoever mm -hmm. makes shows like that needs to watch SVU. <laughs> a few times. Well, it'll be a bench and we'll set them straight. I'm just saying. Yeah, so, well, did you enjoy the episode? Yeah. Okay. Especially when it killed her. <laughs> well, <laughs> anything you're looking forward to going forward? Silica doesn't uh, show up again, if that helps. Thank God. At least there's that. Are there more dragons? Like, or is she the only character who gets a dragon and then she's annoying as shit? There is another dragon, but it is not a pet. Well, I killed that. <laughs> so thanks. All right. Well, thank you everyone for tuning in. Um, so I completely went brain dead there for a minute. Anyway, like I said, thank you for tuning in. I'll, I'll just bring up random things if you like, so you can go on some kind of rant or something if you weren't brain dead, like Pokemon. Poor no. Gosh. <laughs> anyway, so. Uh, if you rants. enjoyed the video, there were lots of rants today. I wasn't saying just from you, I was saying in general. <laughs> if you liked the video, go ahead, comment, and subscribe. Um, and don't forget to look, comment, like, and subscribe. Wow, I'm, I'm going to get better, I promise. Right? We're going to get better? I'm not the problem. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I love you too. <laughs> So like, comment, and subscribe. I don't uh, have to do these intros and outros. That's all you, buddy. I just sit here and react and swear and pet Max on the fun. <laughs> don't forget, though, uh, you can also go ahead and hit that bell. And there is a bell, right? Isn't there a bell? I don't know. Should we check again? Sure, we'll check again off screen. <laughs> um, 
Oh wait, now I... Yeah. <laughs>